man, this rainforest is so big, and there are no street signs anywhere. Who's going to be able to find me? I know. Hello? I'm lost. Could you find me, please? Where are you? I'm in the Amazon, near the big trees. OK, keep calm, have patience. You just gave me your relative location. That means in relation to another place. For example, the trees in this case. A relative location can be a good start with travel time, distance, direction, or a landmark. But it won't help me to find you there. I mean, think about it. There are trees everywhere. What I need is some more information. I more. Yeah, I need your absolute location so I can know exactly where you're at. That's impossible. How do I give you that? And I don't know how long I can last. There's poisonous frogs, anacondas, and bats. Relax. I just need your exact position on Earth. It's universal to everyone. It has to work. We describe it with coordinates of latitude and longitude. It won't be long, my dude. See, the globe is covered with a grid of lines. They can be of great help when there's something to find. Lines? All I see are animals that are scary. The lines aren't visible. They're imaginary. I see the equator. Where you at, my dude? Lines east to west, that's latitude. Lines north to south, that's longitude. I'ma find you on a grid. Hold on, my Dude, I see the equator, where you at, my dude? Lines east to west, that's latitude. Lines north to south, that's longitude. I'ma find you on a grid, hold on, my dude. I don't know what you've been told, but lines of latitude run east to west around the globe. They're measured in degrees, you need that knowledge. Degrees like temperature or what you get in college? No, like angles, check out the symbol. It's a little circle, really pretty simple. The equator is the zero degree line of latitude. I'm about three degrees south, now you have a clue. The degrees increase as you move away to the north or the south where the penguins stay. Uh, the north pole's at 90 degrees north and the south pole is at 90 degrees degrees south, of course. Okay, so where you at? Why are you waiting? Well, latitude is only half the equation. Three degrees south could be Kenya or Brazil. So I need the longitude to seal the deal. Longitude lines run north to south, also known as degrees or meridians. Hey, the prime meridian is the zero degree line of longitude that runs through Greenwich, UK. It divides the earth into two more hemispheres, the eastern and the western. Listen here. Each go up to 180 degrees. I'm at 60 degrees west. Save me, please. I see the equator. Where you at, my dude? Lines east to west. That's latitude. Lines north to south. That's longitude. I'ma find you on a grid. Hold on, my dude. I see the equator. Where you at, my dude? Lines east to west. That's latitude. Lines north to south. That's longitude. I'ma find you on a grid. Hold on, my dude. So the coordinates give you the place where the two lines meet at one point in space. Three degrees south. 60 degrees west, you have my coordinates, so put them to the test! Okay? Are you gonna come and rescue me? Cause I'm really scared! I really appreciated the lesson! But, now will be a good time to come through.